Cut it out. It's Kingdom. Today we're back with another Tuesday tutorial. Today's liberal is going to be on the sub base liberal slash 808 liberals, whichever one you want to call it. But the. This one is super fun. I love to use this one a lot. You can use really cool tones with it. Um, it hits super heavy on stage. It just positioning wise and air wise, that's where this one's gonna trick you up. So during this tutorial, keep that in mind. Don't be afraid to really use your air and really use a mirror if you have to. That's what I did. Really make sure you're focusing on the position of your face, okay? If you have to, if you're on your phone watching this tutorial right now and you gotta pause my face in the liberal and then you gotta look at yourself and that's totally fine. I you, I literally had to do that. I would watch people on stage or I'd watch people in circle jams back in the day on Swiss and uh, some people would hit like a and I was like, oh, that's like a zipper, you know? <laughs> I really had to sit there and just kind of focus on it. So if you have to do that with this tutorial, please do because positioning on this one is gonna be major, major key. But yeah, let's get into this. Step one, um, I feel like this one, like I said, you, you need that perfect position type of thing and you, I feel like trying to learn just this liberal is gonna be really hard. So. Not trying to plug my tutorials, I know I always do, sorry, but go watch that inhale tutorial liberal for, or go, inhale tutorial, yeah, go learn how to breathe, yeah. <laughs> okay, go, go watch the inhaled liberal tutorial is what I meant, sorry. Go watch that one first because it'll get you the concept of a liberal, and to do this one, I'm going to be starting it at a liberal, so if you don't have liberal, you see the problem, go, go watch it. So starting with a liberal, step one, okay? So let's, Kind of like the, when we were learning the lip rolls, remember I told you we we're learning the zipper and I was like, don't worry about the tone. Same thing here. We're just learning lip roll. Just don't worry about the tone. We're not trying to, and we're also not trying to, we're just trying to hit a, wherever it's at. Okay, just hit a something. Okay, so for me, that's just what's hitting right now. It's comfy. So I'm gonna go with cool. Okay, step one, just get your lip roll. Get a tone and try to hold and control it. Get a some type of tone with your lip roll. Hit it and try to hold it for me. Don't like, okay, cool, I got it. Try to hold it, so try to. For as long as you can hold it. You know how a lot of us probably, when you first learn lip rolls, because I did it, you're like. And you do it. Try to get it to a point you're able to control it and just get a nice steady. Cool. So, step one. Step two is going to be all about position. Inhale, sub, inhale, sub. Watch the face. Okay, now I know you're probably thinking that my jaw is shifting or something. It is not. This is where I think everyone is always getting tricked up with sub bait when they're watching sub bass tutorials or when they're trying to learn sub bass. You know how on the inhaled lip roll tutorial, I told you guys how you can kind of mess with the tones and as you're breathing in, imagine going like, yo, yo, right? But imagine your lips are glued. Remember I was said like your lips are stuck, but then try to go like, oh. For now, I want you guys to work all your liberals on this tutorial when you're working this on an O. Reason being is because that sub bass, it's really hard to do it in an E. Like, everything's kind of O and it's kind of O. Everything's very open, dropped jaw and all that, okay? So work all your liberals for now. Try to, try to work the O's, okay? And this one, if you haven't worked the O's yet, it's gonna probably make you use a lot of your air. Um, it, you gotta develop the lungs. It takes a lot of time, okay? So we're hitting, we have our liberal. We're doing it in an O, okay? From there, you know how when we do a zip, or from liberal, like the inhaled one, if we tighten, it goes to a zipper. Don't tighten from here, because if you tighten from there, that's, the, that's why we get zippers. Watch, this is, gets all, tight that becomes a zipper watch right we don't want that what's happening is this lip it's almost like your lips are you're trying to almost curl your lips in more okay so what i mean is this if you're trying to hit you hit your lip roll in an o if you go higher you notice this doesn't 
titan it's almost like over here goes oh like that because that's literally what's happening is i'm taking this part of the lip roll that's hitting and i'm tightening here in the center I'm okay so yes the side technically is still going in like a zipper but rather than trying to make the the focus point if you want to call it or the pressure point here and it's more over here and see what I'm, that's why you can hear the tone that's where it's coming from it's not over here it's over here It's all that little pocket. I'm gonna tilt my head back a little bit. You'll notice when I, whew, sorry, I'm using a lot of lip rolls right now. You'll notice when I hit the 808s. It's almost like there's a gap. So that's what I'm saying. Don't, when I say tighten, don't tighten zip wise. Cause now look, the lip changes. No, no, you're just tightening here. And to tighten more of them, I know it's kind of a tricky concept. Just inhale more. So imagine trying to go higher, but when you do that, try to take your breath and really try to, <coughs> sorry, I'm breathing a lot on this and doing a lot of liberals, but really make sure you're inhaling on this. So And that's how, you can hear all this, the basing it, that's all sub bass stuff. That's all sub bass, okay? All sub bass really is, is the lip roll in an O position, right? and more tuck of the lip, which requires way more air. I'm just gonna hit a couple notes and then sub bass them just so you guys can see my face. Maybe this will help for reference. See what I'm saying? How the face like, it's all shift it looks like a shift it's all this it's just almost like here's my lips they're just curling in more if that makes sense like they're both just curling in more and i have to breathe way more to get them to hit those notes the tricky part with this is your breath okay kind of like the other lip rolls remember i told you your jaw muscles kind of have to develop this sounds weird your lungs are gonna have to develop i remember way back i was in high school when i first learned this sound and when I first got it, it was not like a, I know I'm teaching you guys all this, how it sounds, but it was not like a, when I first hit it. Like when I first tried to hit a, it was literally like that small. Okay, so if you're starting really small, hey, that's okay. We all gotta start and develop it and grow it and grow it and grow it. The more you work it, the more you practice, the more persistent you are, I promise you, your lungs are gonna increase because this is such a big inhaled sound that you're working out your lungs. So they're gonna have to grow and they're gonna get adjusted to this feel that you're trying to push your body on. You know what I mean? Your body's not, <laughs> kind of what I always say in all the other tutorials, like throw bass and all those. We don't ever talk like this. So when, or we don't ever talk like this. So when you first try to do it, it's it doesn't happen like that, you know? Whenever you speak, it's outwards, you never have to inhale. You never have to inhale. And on top of that, let's say like, you're out of breath or something. Let's say you, you, had to, you were in PE, you had to go do the mile run. Usually when you're done, you're like, you're never just like, like just, it's just like inhaling straight air, okay? That's what you're doing on this sub bass, on this 808. It's really tricky at first, okay? And it's not because it's a hard lip roll or, the, it's the positioning, getting the concept of tightening, but not the side. Tightening all that. And then getting that breath and just. And just take a nice breath in, okay? Really, really, really tricky sound. Practice it and make sure you're persistent with your practice. But yeah, guys, that's the tutorial for today. I hope this helped you guys. I know I didn't say it on the last two videos, but if you guys need help or you guys have any questions or anything like that, or if you guys need help with the sounds, or leave a comment, find me on social media, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, all that good stuff. Send me a video. Hey, Kingdom, I'm trying to learn sub bass. Am I on the right track? Please feel free to send me videos. I always, as you guys know, if you've hit me up, I reply to all of you guys. Is there a ton of you guys? Oh yeah. Do I love it? Oh yeah. Does it take time? Oh yeah. But it's worth it because I gotta help all you guys out. This one's a really tricky lip roll. This and dry lip rolls are the hardest, I think, in my opinion. After this, it starts getting a little bit easier. I promise you guys. I promise. So next week, it'll be a little bit easier. But yeah, I'll see you guys for the next tutorial. I hope you guys have a good day.